How's it going guys? Panda back with another video. I know it already came out the video today, but honestly I just have some shit on my mind. Um, I just wanted to talk about. And I know this shit, this shit is it's a fucking video game. It's not real life shit, but it's about World of Warcraft. <laughs> I've been doing World of Warcraft for about 14 years now, and since I was a kid, me and my dad used to fucking play way back in the day, and WoW's just changed, and you know, maybe I'm just fucking living in the past and the nostalgia of Grizzly Hills right here, <laughs> like, like a lot of us are, and um, personally, I've just seen a lot of YouTube videos, and with, with Blizzard coming out with the, um, if we, if we want BC survey or whatnot, and I really think about it, and honestly, um, the way Blizzard handles certain, certain aspects of the game, the way Blizzard just sees this as dollar signs, in my opinion, and just a a lot of stuff that I just want to go over and um, right now it's just really irritated me honestly and it's really discouraged me to play the game um, the, the, the community is great there's a lot of people that actually care and a lot of people that have actually played WoW for years and years and they don't really want to see it go down a shithole because of a company um, but basically uh, this is just a little rant video I wanted to make and just get up to show off my chest and see if you guys agree. I know this video is not going to blow up. Um, a lot of my videos don't. Only a couple of them have, but I don't do it for I don't do this for popularity or for money, you know. I, I get donations on Twitch and I get um, subs and I'm very grateful for that and I try to give back as much as I can. But um uh, I I want to make this video just to speak from my heart um, how I really feel about all of this shit. Um, about Shadowlands and about honestly ever since fucking Kata, I feel like um, Blizzard has really just gone downhill with their um, with the developing. I, I I don't I don't feel like they've put in their all into it since Kata. You know that they, they they hit their peak and they just got money and then they're like fuck it. You know we we reach we reach the top of the mountain. You know we'll just make we'll just make money from here on out. You know we don't, we don't really care about the community. Um, I'm not saying, you know, 100% they don't care, but I'm just saying the, the shit shows more than the, you know, the love and, like, if they really cared about a video game, they would, they would do their all to make it, um, you know, perfect, right? Because, you know, a lot of us, a lot of us grew up on World of Warcraft, you know? We, we, we have stories of our parents and stories of, um, our, our childhood friends that we used to play WoW with, and now it's just, it's just not what it used to be, right? Um, my main concern is uh, TBC. I really, really, really started playing with my dad in TBC, and um, TBC is just—it's such a great expansion. It's it's classic WoW, but on roids, right? It's even better. Every class is viable. You can do anything you want in the game in TBC. And personally, you know, I, I feel like they might ruin it if they come out with with uh, classic TBC servers. I know this is a long ways away. You know, fucking Phase Five Encourage isn't even out yet, but um. You know, it's it's not it's not too late, Blizzard, to you know listen to your community and do things the right way, right? Don't please don't release BC pre-patch, you know, or excuse me, post-patch, when everything was nerfed and it was no fun. You know, now they cater, Blizzard caters to the audience of um, casual gamers way too much. Um, I would consider myself semi-hardcore. I wouldn't even say hardcore, but enough to where I, you know, I should still need consumes to br to, get to clear BWL, right? Like it should still be difficult, and um, I mean, we'll see in the upcoming phases with phase five and phase six if um, Encourage and Nax are going to be difficult. Uh, I, I doubt it. You know, they would rather um, take the easy route and make people people happy. You know, what I'm saying with easier content than actually give them a challenge because people don't like a challenge and you know anymore they don't like having to talk to each other and fucking you know lfg you know lfr you know there's all these there's all these different um outlets you know just to get away like, like get yourself away from actually having a conversation with a human being um i wouldn't even consider myself very um like turtle you know like turtled or whatever um shy i guess just is a good word i wouldn't even consider myself that i just um <clears throat> i wish blizzard would just you know and give the people what they want. Um, Classic's been good so far, and um, in my opinion, you know, there's been a little certain things that's just, you know, pretty annoying that they've done. But it maybe we all, you know, maybe our nostalgia nostalgia goggles were on, you know. Um, maybe we did think Classic was a lot harder and and was it more amazing than it really was, right? But one thing I'll never forget was hitting level 70 with my dad on his warrior 
his troll warrior, him not knowing the abilities because he had to get his glasses to read them. And me playing a disc freeze and having to kill him while he runs the flag down mid with 30 alliance on my ass trying to kill me while he tries to capture the flag. Those are the memories I remember, you know. The, like, like the fun, good times, right? And, um, you know, maybe I am living in the past, but is it really bad to live in the past? I mean, I know, like, like you know, time moves, moves on, but maybe we don't, you know. Is it really bad to, to have memories like that, you know? Um... I know this video is all over the place, but it's just, you know, it's my thoughts. It's what I'm going over, and I know a lot of you guys can relate about your childhood um, with, with World of Warcraft. And, it, you know, it's a great game. You know, there's so I have countless months and years spent on this game, and my main concern is TBC, because that's where I really got big with World of Warcraft, and it's really where me and my dad <laughs> spent a lot of our time leveling together, you know, um... We couldn't even do the sun well or whatever it was called because we didn't have our epic flying mounts and even something like like that you know it's these days they would just be like oh no have those moments give you you know here's your fucking here's a free mount right you know but that's that's not what it is it's, it's not necessarily just be, being given a free mount it's the, it's the like you know it's the thought that like oh shit you know i gotta go farm some gold so i can go do this um it, blizzard just ca caters way too much towards the the soft you know the, the snowflakes as i would call them and um they like like the, the, the casual environment i feel like and it's, it's not a bad thing to live in the past in my opinion you know always be different that's why i always preach on my channel always go big dick never go small dick because you know each and every single person has potential and there's no reason for you to waste that potential you know if somebody tells you you know you can't do something, dude. You can do it. Fuck them, dude. They're mad. At, they're mad because you know they couldn't fucking you know do do something. So they're gonna you know throw you down. So basically, fuck them. And another topic I wanted to go over was um, if I think that they should even release TBC. Um, down in my heart, I want to say no. I want to say no. I I I I I think the private servers and a lot of people have played on a lot of private servers that have been amazing, and are honestly better than any fucking server that Blizzard can come out with. Like, do we really still need spell batching? Like, I I have a 1080. Uh, you know what I'm saying? There's people with two 2080s that play well. Like, do we really still need spell batching? So, that's just what I mean by a way that Blizzard has fucked it up. But personally, I don't think that Blizzard should come out with TBC. They're gonna do it. It's gonna come out. It's already made. They just gotta find a good patch and you know, obviously release the rest of the classic content. Um, but personally, I think they shouldn't because, again, maybe it's my nostalgia goggles. But at the same time, I'll, I would rather relive the memories I am now with these private servers and it, they're amazing. They're they're perfect and I've done tons of giveaways and everything and I just personally, Blizzard, if you do come out or somehow some way you guys see this video. Um, if you guys come out with, uh, with TBC, please, please listen to your fucking audience for once, dude. These, these are people that are taking time out of their day to play your content. I know you're getting paid, but still, dude, people, people love this game. This is a lot of people's lives and honestly, it is people's lives. People do this as a job. Um, and I've been more than grateful, you know, to have the community I have on Twitch, but if Blizzard can do one thing right, it's... Just don't fuck up TBC. Um, try to end Classic with a good note. You know, make Nax hard, please, and make AQ difficult, please. That's all I'm asking. Just one last note I want to end on. Um, just don't, don't chat. Don't think that it's a, it's a bad thing, guys, to have nostalgia goggles on and to remember where you came from and the game that you played and the the moments you had. Nobody could ever take those moments away from you. They could ruin the game, but they can't ruin your, you know, your moments, right? That you had, your memories. And uh, with with Shadowlands coming up, and I know that they're trying to make it a great, very good expansion. And, you know, as Wingold and a whole bunch of other streamers are, you know, hyping it up to, you know, it's fun, you know, new expansion. But I'm going to be honest with you guys, WoW hasn't been the same since, since Wrath. It really hasn't. You know, like, we've had good expansions and i wouldn't even consider them good i mean on the scale of fucking kata or you know anything else legion was decent right you know panda there's some furry shit going on but besides that there hasn't been a lot of whole a whole lot in my opinion um 
you know, maybe, maybe it's me. Maybe, you know, maybe you guys loved all the expansions and everything, but I'm going to tell you right now, and I'm not going to steal too much content away from one of my friends that gave me this idea. Um, I'll let him make the video, but Shadowlands is not going to be good, ladies and gentlemen. Look up the definition of insanity. Doing the same thing over and over and over, expecting a different outcome. And I feel that's what Blizzard's doing. They're coming out with expansion after expansion, expecting a different outcome. Or maybe I'm wrong. Maybe they're not. So, it's been Panda, guys. And I love you. Have a good night. And I will see you on Twitch. Peace.